A very good afternoon, guys, from New Zealand Christchurch. And uh, we just arrived. I'm equipping myself because it's 10 degrees, but it's really cold. And I don't know if it's going to be enough or not. But now I'm waiting for girls they are over there. So we're going to the city for a little walk. Uh, it's really going to get cold. Uh, let's, let's see. Say hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's uh, uh, Malaysia over here. First class. <laughs> You know where you're gonna be a star now? It's YouTube really? video. It's a YouTube. It's a live? No, oh. but it's YouTube. I'm gonna edit and I'm gonna put it live everywhere. Everyone's gonna see oh, that. Really? <laughs> oh, guys, imagine I had to work with this lovely girl. Should I say names? No names here. Uh, for yes. 14 hours. My name is beautiful. I'm single <laughs> and available. I'm single too. <laughs> oh, guys, can you imagine this? Oh, my gang. And here, where are you from? I'm gonna Slovakia. Slovakia. And my Slovakia. another colleague from Slovakia. We work together. So we have now layover here in Christchurch and then we fly to Sydney back. So we're gonna take you everywhere with us to the city and to show you everything. <laughs> okay, so here's a little interview. Why do you fly? Oh, I fly. When I was young, I have a dream. I wanna fly first class. <laughs> Oh my god, I, as soon as I grown up, oh my god, I realized buying first class ticket is so expensive. I can't afford it. And then I changed my dreams. I said, since I cannot afford the ticket, let me just work in first class and every day I fly first class and I get paid. <laughs> so that's the story of her life. <laughs> Please, if you want to see me fly Emirates, you will see me there. Guys, we honestly had so much fun, and here is another one from the UK. Cheers. And Can we have work. Precious uh, coffee, guys. Precious <laughs> coffee. To be honest with you, this is natural, no makeup. When I put on my makeup, wow. <laughs> Humor. I wish I could have same, but unfortunately, I'm not that uh, lucky. She is shy. I'm not. They're very shy, yeah. My name is called Shy, but I'm not shy anymore. So, why Dubai? Why Dubai? I love Dubai. It's safe. It's a way for my parents. Whatever I say, they won't hear it. Maybe they're watching this video right now. Oh, they they don't unless. You put Chinese subtitle, <laughs> they don't understand English. <laughs> Our hotel is somewhere over there, so we're gonna cross it and then find a place for dinner. This is my gang. Guys, say hi! Hi! <laughs> Where are we going now? I don't bother me. I don't know, I'm confused. <laughs> so we got a map that we found a we lake. Have to get through the botanical gardens. Yes. Yeah, we are going there. there. The city, but I'm not entirely sure we women where the botanical care gardens about are. Our look. Okay, oh, there are shy. ducks. There are ducks. Let me show you guys. They're so cute. Guys, oh, so catch many. one of them and then we barbecue tonight. No, <laughs> we're going to do this. <laughs> Kids are going through the park on bicycles. Very nice, yes? Yes, I feel like I want to have babies. <laughs> oh, really? You want to have babies? No. <laughs> oh, look at this, guys. Chia, it's for you. Love. Love notes. Uh, it's for you. Home. Who was this lucky man who put it here? I don't know. Someone is lack of love. <laughs> uh, so where are we going now? Are you hungry, by the way? No, I'm not hungry. Mm -hmm. I'm on diet. No comments. <laughs> Okay, so guys, tomorrow the plan is to wake up at 5.30 to get ready to grab breakfast at 6 and at 7 to catch a car, to get a car and to You go wake up the... at 5. At 5, yes. I wake up at 6.45. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so. I just brush my teeth, put on the clothes and I'm ready. Yeah. So we go... Um, huh? so no, I will tell you later. <laughs> It's not for public, okay? It's, it's not for public? No? <laughs> Look at these two guys. So cute. Oh, so nice. Oh, the winter storm left. I wanted to show you guys what it actually left. The problem right now that we faced is that we are missing clothes. We don't have jackets, hats, scarves, and tomorrow as we're going to the mountain, it's going to be super cold and we really need it. Like, we really need our equipment. Yes. For me. And for me as well. 
getting close to this Christ uh, college, guys. If you remember last time I showed it to you, I went inside, it was a college for boys only. And yeah, it's like Hogwarts, exactly. <laughs> it's so nice, it's very beautiful, honestly. Can someone just move that van so I can take a nice photo? <laughs> beautiful. This tram. Very nice. And we're going to the Botanic Gardens for a moment just to check it out. Christchurch Botanic Gardens over here. Nice. Tia. Yes. Tell me something about yourself. Tell me how long do you fly? I've been flying for 14 years. 14 years? Yes. And you're from Malaysia? Yes. Wow! And right now, new uh -huh. aspiring people are watching you. Those who you know, just finished college, who maybe 21 or 20. Yes. And they want to fly like you for many years, travel. Tell me something about, tell them something about this lovely job. Yes. That you're now in New Zealand, another side okay, of the Okay, guys, world. you stop there. Come. What? See? If I can become a cabin crew, I believe that everyone can be a cabin crew too. Seriously. Yeah, it's an ins inspiration. If I can become a cabin crew, cabin crew is not a, like an impossible uh, job to be. Everyone yeah, can do it. Yeah, you have a dream, you just have to go for it, right? Yes, you have to work on it. It's not some, something is like you need to look uh, super beautiful and realistic. But look at me. I'm so ordinary. Look, 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 look. Because she's flying not for one, two years, 14 years. She's still smiling, she's enjoying this life. <laughs> it's not about the, the money or anything. It's just like when you're doing a job, it just, it's just work. But after the work, then it's your life. It's more important how you want to live your life. That's how you choose how you want to live your life. It's not the job is going to restrain you. Mm -hmm. So I'm sure even though you're not a cabin crew, you're doing other job, you still need to enjoy your life. Yeah, yeah. It's not because we are traveling to this beautiful country, our life is amazing. Everyone life still can be amazing yes. even though you're not cabin crew. Fly with us, <laughs> fly at Marat, <laughs> fly, fly in okay, first okay. class. <laughs> In first class, just to meet her because she's amazing, guys. She's gorgeous, honestly. I flew with you when I was uh, in economy, yes. grade two. I flew with her when I was in business, and now first we fly together, same cabin, same jokes, uh, fun. It, it's really amazing, guys. So I remember this lovely lady. And, I also uh, remember her. She always is, looks beautiful. I don't know how she maintain it. She's so pretty. <laughs> 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 yeah. Wow! Look at Actually, the pine tree. Yeah, this is the pine tree, the the huge one. It's not the one that you have for Christmas. It's different for sure. It's some UNESCO protected uh, breed. Uh, not don't breed. How do you say the the breed of tree? <laughs> <laughs> breed animal. Hi. <laughs> just it's just beautiful. Let me show you guys. Yeah. Even though if I'm poor one day, I will still be the poorest and happiest person on earth. Poorest and happiest person on earth. Yeah. That's why I always say, guys, that you have to go for it. You have to do it. You don't do it this year. You don't do it next year, third year. And then still, you're going to regret it. You're still going to go for it. But you're going to lose time. Yes. So just go for it. Trust me. If you travel every day, the next month, maybe I'll forget the beauties of Christchurch. But if you travel only once in your lifetime to Christchurch, you will remember this forever. All details. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's true. It's really true. Yeah. Guys, look what I can see. Do you see this bird? It's a, it's a green bird. What is it? Hummingbird. I don't know. No, no, no. But this is so nice. Wow, but she's green. Where is she? Where is she? Oh, keep away. Lindsay's from UK. Hi, from London. Yeah. When you when you start flying and then new crew are coming from I know from different countries, do they understand what you're saying? Because your accent is very strong. My accent. I will tell you honestly. Is it really on the plane? It, it, yeah. On the plane, everyone says I sound Australian because I'm a bit soft. Okay. I've been in Dubai for 14 years, so. 14 years yeah, in Dubai. A really long time. 11 years Emirates, so I'm a bit oh, wow. soft now. If I go home for a week and then I come back, no one understands me because then it's really quick. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and okay. nothing. But I can soften it on the plane. I think it's actually, if you listen to me tomorrow when we get on the plane, okay. it changes. It changes. It just right? goes soft and everyone's like, oh, are you Australian? <laughs> I don't know. Why does it sound Australian? 
Like yeah, so that's so. Uh -huh. <laughs> so when you work somewhere where you have many nationalities, guys, you really, really have to, you know, yeah. uh, switch, you know, flip yeah. and try to understand maximum. But sometimes I Emirates I, especially is makes it complicated. <laughs> yeah, many, 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 many. You have people from everywhere. I remember myself uh, listening to girls from UK or uh, Scotland. Yeah. I, I couldn't understand when they talked to each other. I couldn't. So I remember my first ever flight to Glasgow, which was the first time I ever went to Scotland, like it was with Emirates. And I'd, by this point I'd been to Lagos, which is a very strong accent that everyone really understands, to, um, to uh, lots of other places around the world and I'd kind of managed. I did my first Glasgow flight. Didn't have a clue what anyone was saying. Not and you're from UK, <laughs> and you could not understand. You see, guys, so now I'm talking about Russian not girl who came. Not a and... clue. I was like, eh? <laughs> you, you want the what? <laughs> I don't know what they're saying. So yeah, Scottish is it's wonderful, and it, now I've I've got some very good Scottish friends, so I think I'm a bit better at it. But it is yeah. not easy to understand, especially on the plane. Yeah. When you're not. Focused. Yeah. What do you do if you have a passenger who is asking you something but you don't understand what he's saying? You know the accent. Smile really you him. Him. Does it happen? Yeah, of course. It uh, happens. <laughs> uh, yeah, you, you have to change from sort of being vague and being aware of everything to suddenly all focus on them and you ask again nicely and a big smile and hope they don't get pissed off. That's the <laughs> advice from 11 yeah. year old. Um, Kevin yeah. crew. Oh, that's so <laughs> sad. <laughs> Eleven years. <laughs> oh, no. Almost sunset time. Quite Christchurch life. And we are moving to the city. There is the rails where the tram is going. And uh, we are discussing the whale watching tomorrow in Sydney. That's the little bit of city for you guys. What's really interesting here about the weather, you know guys, when it's plus 10, but everybody is dressed different style, t-shirts, shorts, jackets, uh, artificial coat, like the fur coat, and uh, oh, something nice, woodcraft gallery. Mm. Oh. Cherry blossom guys, at this time of the year. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah no, no, I, I went and there's... Um, so oh, there's girls are going to the high street straight away for shopping. And that's what we catch on the way. Oh, that's very nice, very family-like. We found uh, in the city center this uh, construction with the stones and they have different writings on top of it. This is the moon of stones at the edge of the river by which travelers in the high country indicate a place of departure and the place to regain the shore. I don't know, maybe it's a monument. Guys, if you know, please comment because I, I really would love to know more. And here is the cathedral that was, I believe, that was destroyed by the earthquake that was in Christchurch a few years back. And um, that's how it looks like. Let's get closer. Uh, I don't know, I didn't do my research and to be honest, I just was still stumbled across this cathedral now. Hopefully nobody was inside when it happened. But that's how it looks like. And we are facing this and uh, another construction over here. Christchurch, as far as I remember, is famous for graffiti. So there are a lot of them around the city and uh, we are we saw a few of them already and here is another one just on the side and the sculpture that I like is here. I'm not sure if it conveys any meaning but if it does it's super nice. I love it. So that's another side. The, this looks like a city center and uh, this one you can rent because I saw a few of them in the city. Uh, going for for clothes. Wendy. Um, I found a very nice <laughs> shop. Shut the front door. Here we go. We just went inside Kathmandu over there, but we didn't find jackets. It was, a, yeah, not what we need. Yes, we are going to this fancy H&M. <laughs> guys, I'm getting this hat, which is this color, and I'm getting this scarf also this for tomorrow's trip and I need to get also leggings leggings because it's gonna be very cold tomorrow in the mountains super cool now <laughs> ready to go he's not even looking girls are ready to go to continue our journey yes, yes. we also got jacket and we got scarf so these two things we we jacket oh, for how much 30 dollars this lovely H&M jacket look at this with the waist oh, beautiful <laughs> and still within allowance 
So that's why, guys, we went to the body shop because we wanted to ask for a recommendation about eatery, about food and dinner. And what did we get? A place called little High, High Little Little High Eatery, not far away from so here. So it's got Little Social, it's a coffee shop, Bacon Brothers, Caribe so Latin, we're probably gonna sushi have there Georgia, now. Egg grains. And we came to another store, very cute shop. I love this uh, cups, guys. I really love it. I just searched Instagram, they have page. And this mug is also so cute. You put coffee and then you drink and you suddenly see something there and it's already it's cute. <laughs> so what are you getting here? Show me. You're getting the stress ball that looks this. like a globe. It's the globe. So when I'm mad at the world, I can squish it. <laughs> but I don't do any actual real damage. Okay, so stress-free life now. Very nice. Yeah. Meanwhile, I'm thinking, shall I do I need it in my life as well? Because I have no stress, Lindsay, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Stress. Do you have stress in your life? No. <laughs> no. Just so you don't, I don't need want to destroy the world. Okay. <laughs> That's a good one as well. Huh? Oh my gosh, look at this, guys. Oh, Avocado baby. Oh, and as we're walking, guys, I found a map with lights. And I like it so much. You know how much I love travel, travel, travel things. Look at this map. Wow. I love it. I've just got Amot. This one's to go tomorrow with me for the tour. And one banana. That's it. That's gonna be my food. It's completely dark now and we are searching for the place which might be somewhere there. Here we are guys, we found it. Yes. Lindsay, yes. Lindsay could find it. She found Malaysian restaurant. Yeah. You can smell it. Malaysian <laughs> restaurant, yeah, and she said it might be the winner of our choice, so let's see. Yes. Well for me. For you, yeah, <laughs> dumplings. She brought dumplings today on the flight. Can you um, imagine? So that's the place. A lot of choice and it's like big and they have little stalls inside the restaurant and it's very nice. So we're trying to find one for us now and she is already checking menu. I'm gonna check my vegan. Your vegan option. Oh, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yes. Maybe kids menu? No? It's not enough. <laughs> yeah, very nice. That's a burger place now. And here is a Thai place. Chicken also on the menu. Anything? Yes. Lots of curry. Yeah. <laughs> curry. Look at the table. Lindsay is there waiting for us and we're still searching, searching. So I'm getting now a uh, black pepper chicken over here and edamame. Can't wait. Wow. So Veronica was the first one to get her meal. Veronica, can you please barbecue pork? Barbecue pork. Okay. Guys, I just got my food, which looks super amazing. Look at this. That is chicken with rice. Super delicious and nice. And I also got edamame. How's it nice? Wow. Enjoy. <laughs> and here Lindsay came. And guess what did you bring? Uh, we have pork ramen and oh. chicken kalash. Wow. That looks yeah. like I want to eat it. <laughs> yeah. A foodie. Food him. Yeah. Okay. Check the gallery. Oh, the picture shows like two. Wow. Very nice. Oh, it's a food. Very nice. All around the world. Yes. Very nice. <laughs> Guys, we just got our roster. So here is a chia checking roster of Lindsay. And that's the moment. Okay, wow. go for it. No, I lost it. <laughs> what, what did you get? Say. Um, I got Rome. I got Seychelles. Yay! Yeah. Okay. Um, you know, some days off. No, I've got Rome. Oh, yeah, have Rome. What else? Auckland. Yeah. No, no. Auckland was this edited oh, one. Okay. 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 Yeah. We just came back to the hotel now, guys. Oh, and we're uh, to do the same thing in our rooms. So, uh, everybody want to say bye to you because I'm gonna continue, but everybody just says bye. 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 See you tomorrow. <laughs> And I've just arrived in my room. Girls went to check roster and to try to swap the flights because now it's a very busy time for that to try to change flights and to try to get destinations which you were bidding for and which you really want. And I'm going to wake up tomorrow, guys, at around 6 a.m. So we have a breakfast early. And then at 7 a.m. we have two cars. 13 of us are going to this center. And I really, really, really can't wait. I want to go so much. And my Instagram is Skyflight Girl over here. Good night and have sweet dreams. Bye!